Hello and welcome back to DJD Entertainment. My name is Darcy and today I will be discussing how to wire a DMAX lighting system. Let's get started. Now, when wiring a DMAX lighting system, you start at your DMAX lighting desk and work out to your fixtures. I am going to wire up two LED quad bars with red, green, blue and white diodes from Showtech and a knockoff atomic strobe light. First of all, you need to place and rig all your fixtures around your room and plug in the power for your fixtures in your console. I am going to speed this part up as I am sure that you know how to do it, but if you don't, please look at the user manual for your fixture and or lighting console. After plugging in the power to your console and fixtures, do not turn them on and make sure that they are all powered off. So, when wiring a DMAX lighting system, we start with our lighting console, which in my case is the Strand Lighting 200 console. First of all, you need to be able to understand that there is a male and female side of a DMAX cable. And we always want the male end to point towards the console. So, you are going to need to take a DMAX cable and come out of the female port on your console. And plug it into the male connector on your first fixture. In my case, it is an LED bar. Make sure the cable is plugged in properly, as if you don't do it properly, it can cause communication errors later on between your lighting desk and fixtures. Next, take another DMX cable and run it out of the female connector on that same first fixture and plug it into the male connector on your second fixture. In my case, it is another LED bar. Finally, take another DMX cable and run it out of your second fixture and plug it into the male port on your third fixture. In my case, my third fixture is a strobe fixture, but as you can see, it has a DMAX 3-pin port, so I have to use this converter, which converts a 5-pin male connector to a 3-pin female connector. So I can just plug the male connector of the cable coming out of the second fixture into the converter and plug the converter into the male connector on my third fixture. If you add more fixtures, repeat the previous steps of coming out of the female connector on your third fixture and into the male connector of the next fixture in your daisy chain. Now let's go over all the wiring of the DMX cables in a DMX daisy chain in case you didn't quite understand what I did before. 1. Go to your lighting desk and run a DMX cable out of the female connector and plug it into the male connector on your first fixture. Two. Then, on this first fixture, plug a DMAX cable into the female connector and then plug the other end of the DMAX cable into the male connector on your second fixture. Three. 
Simply repeat these steps if you have more than two fixtures in your lighting system. In the next video, I will be discussing how to control DMX lights and fixtures using addresses and dip switches. Please leave any questions in the comment section below this video and I will reply to you as soon as I can. Remember to like the video if you're enjoying this series of videos as it helps me out in the YouTube algorithm. Also, please consider subscribing to this YouTube channel and have a great day.